Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new episode of Niche. My name is Eros and we're currently in Early Access 0.2.4 and we are playing with the Berry Leaf Tribe in the new jungle update. So we are making some very, very healthy and strong babies, not focusing so much on the cosmetics of the babies, but focusing on just making healthy babies. We're making better life choices. Better life choices in our life are happening. So we're going to continue on and we're going to have little Kiara pick up some food because we are running a little bit low on food, which might be a problem if we, uh, you know, completely run out of food. Uh, we're going to have Eve come over here. Oh my gosh, there's another nest. Another nest over here. We're going to have it and have her breed with Adam and have Eve actually pop into this nest over here. And Adam can actually move over here as well and clear up some of the grasses that are in this area. Uh, there is a little, can we come over here? Oh yeah, we got him. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness, little Leo, little Leo, you got our first little like gopher, like hedgehog thingy in the ground. Um, but we can go ahead and have, let's see, we can have little Apollo actually pop out of the nest over here. And little Romeo, uh, oh, collecting ability too low. Oh, that is so sad. He can't collect anything. That is so sad. Um, but why don't we have him come over here and at least collect up some of the different grasses that are in this area. And a little raindrop over here can go ahead and collect some of the berries over here too. Go ahead and do that. And there we go. We're going to have a brand new baby. Um, hopefully we get some better genetics in this. And here we go. We have a little girl it looks like. And she is... Ooh, she has the normal eyesight. Uh, she does have hemophilia in her recessive. Uh, and she does have the no paw, which is unfortunate. Why Why we have to have no paw everywhere? No paw, no, no, bad, bad, no paw, bad. <laughs> um, let's see. Let's take a look at her little cheat sheet. She's not that strong. She does have a little bit of stealth, smelling, swimming. But not, I'm not overly impressed with you, little girl. Not very overly impressed with you. <laughs> I'm being like, I'm being too harsh on them. I feel bad. I feel so bad. Um, but we're going to name this little one. Why don't we name her Rory? Little Rory over here. Um, she does have the green eyes, like mommy. But we're not focusing on the cosmetics. It's so hard for me to do because I want to like have like certain looks for our creatures. Um, but let's go ahead and breed Adam and Eve together. I think what we're going to do is breed up. Um, oh my gosh. Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Ooh. Oh my goodness. Hello. 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 Uh, blind eye. Short sighted eye. Uh, spit snout. You do have no, you don't have no paw though, which is pretty good. And you do have some new genetics into, uh, you have the H immunity and H and G. Awesome. Okay, so we probably will have this little girl. She's a little teenager right now. Um, join our tribe so we can start playing around with the H immunity and the G immunity. Oh my goodness. But these eyes though, not exactly what I wanted. So we're definitely going to have to work on that. Um, but what I'm focusing, I think what we're going to do is breed up some babies and we're going to take the very best babies that we have to the flowery type of island over here in the future. Um, we're definitely not going to take everybody because last time when I tried to take everybody, bad things happened and Taz killed everybody. If you guys don't know what that means, um, watch the, the previous, uh, niche, uh, <laughs> episodes. Uh, let's go ahead and have Lexi move. Oh, she's already in a nest. She's like, I'm ready to make it a baby. Um, collecting Apollo. You can't collect either. That's so sad. So sad. Let's go ahead and move you over here. Oh, there's a bunny though. And we're going to have Raindrop actually. Um, we don't have enough food to invite her. Not yet. So we're definitely going to have to work on getting food. Hmm. <laughs> we're having a food problem. We're definitely having a food problem. You cannot collect from the berry bush, Romeo. Like, why are you even in this tribe? Like, why? You need to go away. You need to go away. <laughs> we're going to starve to death. We're, we're all going to die. Um, let's go over here, get some of these. Berry leaf. She's going to run away for now, but hopefully um, she can come back. No more food over there. Let's go ahead and do a little quick look. There are some bunnies and some little gophers we can try to get. There is a berry bush over this way, too. So why don't we have a little raindrop start moving out this way to get closer to this berry bush. And we cannot invite her to join our tribe right now because, because we're going to die. <laughs> because we don't have enough food. 
Uh, let's go ahead and have Eve. I guess pop in the nest. We're not going to have enough food, though. Oh, no. All right. So let's take a look at our life choices. And there's going to be some creatures that are going to be taking some damage, unfortunately, in the next turn. Uh, Kiara, she's doing pretty good. She has normal eyes. She has good um, legs. She does have the hemophilia, though, so we're definitely going to have to work on getting the hemophilia out of her genetics. But we're going to make her alpha, so she will not take damage uh, first when they starve. Um, little Rory, I'm kind of disappointed about no paw. Uh, she does have good eyes, though. And disappointed about hemophilia. She's not that strong, though. Hmm. So I'm not sure if I'm going to make her alpha. Uh, let's see. We have little Romeo over here. Who does have claw. He does have the no paw, though. Good eyes. No hemophilia. Hmm. <laughs> see, we have this little guy. You have short-sighted. Short-sighted. And then recessive. Um... Raindrop. Oh, man, I want some better genes. I want some better creatures. We have Apollo here. Uh, we could do Apollo. See, I don't know who's going to take damage, though. Um, but I guess we'll, we'll let fate decide. <laughs> we'll let fate decide. I'll go ahead and skip the turn. Hopefully the next baby that we get is a better. Ooh. Ooh, there we go. All right. So, oh, nice. Oh, my goodness. Perfect. Perfect baby. No hemophilia. Good eyesight. Good legs. You, you're good. You're a little boy. I am so proud of you, little guy. You guy, you have good genes. We're going to name this little cutie Copa. Um, and he is exactly the type of creature that we are looking for with the genetics. I am happy. Eve and Adam, you made a good baby. You made a little good baby over here with Copa. Uh, we're going to make sure that he is alpha rank so he does not take damage because we're going to have a little bit of starving starvation happening right now. So we're going to have everyone that we can go ahead and collect some berries. Oh, I'm so happy about Copa. Copa was the final hope, the last hope. We can go ahead and have little Rory pop out of the nest. Romeo, uh, he cannot even collect anything. Romeo, Romeo, where for out there, Romeo? Why do you not collect things? And let's see, ability. Leo, you can't collect either? Get out of here. Just kidding. Go collect some leaves. Um, come over here. You can go ahead and collect some berries. And Apollo. Oh, you're not going to make it. And I do want to invite this female, but we can't do it right now. And your ability is too low for collecting berries, too. Oh, my goodness. Eve can collect berries, though. So hopefully she can get... Yeah, she got at least over 10, so we're not going to starve this turn, which is good. And Alexi, why don't you... Come over this way and collect some of the grasses over here. And I think we are out of moves, but Copa, Copa, <laughs> Copa, Copa, thank you, Copa. Thank you for existing because you are what we hope for. Little Copa over here. Uh, let's go ahead and skip the turn. Uh, we need more food once again. Oh my goodness. Uh, but little Eve, you can pop out of the nest. Copa, let's see, are you... He's not old enough to go leave the little nest yet because we had Eve still in the nest with him. Uh, I still want to breed. Breed up. Oh, I want to breed Adam and Eve. <laughs> I want to make healthy babies, but we're having food problems. Raindrop, why don't you go ahead and collect. And Leo, you are not able to collect anything, which is sad and unfortunate. You can come over here. And Kiara, you can collect. So why don't you collect these berries? I mean, I mean you might have to have like... Uh, creatures like banished because we don't have enough. Uh, we don't have enough, uh, you know, food for everybody, unfortunately. We're starving. We are starving. Starvation is happening. Uh, Adam, you can go ahead and pick some of those. And we can go ahead and have Lexi come over here and collect some of those. Can you get the bunny raindrop? Uh, no, not yet. Maybe in the next turn. We can have you come over here and Adam. Do do do. See any berry bushes might still have any food. Why don't we have you come over this way and look over here? See if we can find anything. Let's go ahead and do this. So we can we will have to start searching for like the bunnies and go first to collect. And I think we did find all the berry bushes that are on this island. Alright, so hopefully um Kofa is alpha. We have Let's see, where is uh, Kiara? Hopefully she is alpha as well. 
You have Kiara's Alpha, so hopefully those two won't take any damage, and then the other creatures will take damage. It looks like we did get a different mutation. We have Nimble Fingers now, um, which is something that we might want to put in for future babies, just because we are having such a food problem. So go ahead and put Nimble Fingers in, and we'll go ahead and... Let's see, can Eve get any food? Can we get any berries? No, I think they're out of berries over here. Um, but let's go ahead and skip the turn. The creatures are- oh gosh. Eve is dead. Eve is dead. Eve is dead. That's sad. That is so sad. That is- that is so sad. Oh my gosh. Copa. Copa. Kiara. Oh, I'm thinking we should just leave to the other island. Like, now. Just because there's nothing here for us here. I mean, I do want to get that one female because she does have different um, genetics. Let's see. Let's go ahead. Move you over here. Get that. I mean, let's go ahead and invite. She's running away. Why do they always run away from me? I want to invite her to join the tribe. There we go. And now you. Uh, can we have Apollo? Let's invite her. To join there we go because she does have the um the h and g immunity which we do have g but we do not have h yet so that is going to be nice um so copa has b and f and kiara has b and f and we do need to take somebody with g with us because we're going to start thinking about leaving because <laughs> we're having some issues <laughs> Uh, but we're going to make her alpha for now just because she has the special H immunity that we want to work with. Even though her eyesight is not too good. Not too good at all. Um, let's see. Can she collect anything she can? Okay, so let's go ahead and have her collect some berries. And let's see. We want someone else with G. I mean, she does have the G, so we don't necessarily need anyone else. Yeah. So I think... Let's see. We need somebody with A. To bring with us so we don't completely lose like the a immunity because we're gonna be leaving i think very soon so you do have a so maybe we'll take romeo with us so let's go ahead and have romeo pop over here for now and then we'll be taking the newcomer which we are going to rename to let's see what can we name this little creature that we have here she does have the h immunity maybe um harp her heart or hmm hen <laughs> i kind of want to name her hen i don't know why we're gonna name her hen like a little chicken <laughs> we're gonna name her hen uh we're gonna start moving her this way too because we are making an exit to the new island we're just going to be taking i think romeo hen and kiara i think oh and copa copa of course because he's he's really good and I think we might be leaving behind the others. I mean, unfortunately, that's what we're going to have to do uh, in this in this this uh, unfortunate lands. Like, because, like, a lot of these creatures can't even collect certain things. Oh, my gosh. Um, let's see. Let me take a double look, though. And let's take a look at the strength. Because I knew a lot of creatures had good strength. So you have four strength. You have four strength as well. You have five strength. And Kiara has five strength as well. So we do have strong creatures going with us. So I think that's what we're going to have to do, unfortunately. So we're just going to bail. We're just going to bail. Leave behind the family. And uh, we're going we're gonna to go and hopefully find a better life for us in the new island. I thought this would be easier, but we're having food problems. We're having too many babies. Not enough berry pickers. Um, but let's go ahead and skip the turn. A bunch of creatures are going to take damage, unfortunately. Uh, but none of the creatures that we're planning to take with us to the new island. So let's go ahead and have Hen pop over here. We're going to have Copa um, get over here as well. And then we also want to get Kiara, which she can actually... Ooh, let's have... Um, Kiara, you can get this bunny right now. We desperately need food. So why don't you go ahead... Oh, We'll have you move in the next turn. <laughs> oh no. So sad. So sad. Okay. Uh, you can go ahead and collect these berries. Adam. Poor Adam. He's going to die soon. It's very sad that uh, Eve already passed away, unfortunately. And you are not able to collect any food. Uh, but you can collect some of this foliage over here. 
And let's see, I don't think you can collect anything either. Oh wait, you can, okay. Raindrop, you can go ahead and collect this. And Leo cannot collect anything. You can come over here and try to collect some of the foliage. And you also cannot collect anything, so you can just go over here. And Adam, let's see, uh, we don't really, nothing we really do. We're having some problems. Uh, let's go ahead and skip the turn. Bunch of creatures are going to take damage. Once again, we're going to take Kiara and move her over here. There we go. So we can move to the next island. Let's go ahead and get any food that we can before we leave. And let's see. Rory, um, why don't you come? Let's see. Can you get... You can't get you... So many creatures can't get berries. That's so sad. All right, Raindrop, you can go ahead and get the berries that are over here. And Leo, you can kind of, like, get this guy. There you go, Leo. And you are not able to get anything. Uh, you can go ahead and try to get some leaves. Oh, there is a bunny over there that we can try to get, but not going to be very successful. Maybe we can get you. Nope. Gotta get the bunnies, but we can't. All right, running low on food again, um, but we're going to go ahead and let's see. Let's have you come over here. And we're going to go to the bigger and better island with just these four creatures. Hopefully we're making the right choices, but we do have some pretty healthy creatures um, with this three. And then we have the newcomer who has the H immunity. So I will see you guys once we get to the brand new island. And here we are. We have arrived at the brand new flowery island of hope with the berry leaf tribe. There's just the four of them right now. We had to leave a bunch of them behind, unfortunately, which is so sad. Uh, but look at this island. This island is huge. Oh my goodness. Look at that. We have a couple trees. We have a couple uh, different like, types of leaves or like foliage over here. I'm not too sure what that is all about. We do have a lake over here too, so if we ever have some water creatures. Oh, look at that. There's like little waterfalls and everything or something. Oh, that's so cute. We have a couple trees on this island. So hopefully we can find enough food over here. We do have nine food right now, but we have four creatures, so that is going to go very, very quickly. So why don't we go see what we can hear and what we can smell. We can smell a berry bush right over there, which is nice. So let's go ahead and have Romeo investigate over in this area. He is not able to collect any of that, but let's go have him get the leaves. And Hen, she should be, is she able to collect? I don't know if she's going to be able to collect either. Let's see, can anybody get food? Nobody can move and get food right now. We're having some food problems. Um, let's go ahead and skip the turn. I tried really hard. Okay, um, Hen can get berries. So let's go have her collect some of these berries really quickly. And we can go ahead and have Copa collect some of these berries as well. And Romeo is not able to collect anything. So we're definitely going to have to keep that in mind um, as we continue out our tribe. Let's have him collect some of those. And Kiara... You can come over here and collect some of these berries, collect some of these foliage, and let's go ahead and skip the turn. At least nobody's going to starve in the next turn, which is awesome. So let's go ahead and do that. And it looks like Copa is actually old enough to breed now. And let's see, I don't know if it would be better. Uh, we could try to breed with Ken. Hmm. Or would it be better to breed with Kiara? Um, B and F and B and F. I mean, I guess maybe Hen. Um, because Kara is his sister. Mm, all right, we're going to try it. We're going to breed with Hen. And hopefully we can make a pretty healthy baby. Um, once we can find a nest, let's go ahead and collect some food. Romeo is not able to collect anything, so he's going to come over here and look at the grasses. And Kiara, there's no more food over here, so we're going to investigate further on this way. And Hen is going to wander... Um, she can build a nest of her own, but we're going to hold off on that for now because we still are running really, really low on food. We're going to starve. We're going to starve to death. Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh, my goodness. All right. At least there's some more berries um, here for the berry leaf tribe. And Copa can come over here. And we can go ahead and have Romeo investigate a little bit more. Can let's see. I don't think there's any more berries over in this bush, <laughs> unfortunately. Kiara. Oh, yes. Another berry bush. Nice. And we can have Hen try to get that bunny. But the bunny keeps moving over that way. We're getting really, we're not too good at getting bunnies. Um, uh, but yeah, we're still like pretty low 
with the food situation, which is sad. And Romeo, oh no, Romeo's gonna pass away soon. <gasps> Romeo's gonna pass away! So sad. Um, but let's go ahead and skip the turn. And, oh, yes, it's raining. Awesome. Oh, bunny, bunny. Bunny, bunny, bunny. Bunny, that's funny. There we go, we got a little gopher dude. And, let's see, can Kiara get, yes, we can get this bunny over here. We can have Romeo collect the meat of this bunny. And Hen, can you see the bunny? I don't know where the bunny is over here. Why don't we have her come back this way? And Romeo, we can go ahead and get some of this foliage. And we're getting a little bit better on food. Getting a little bit better. Let's go ahead and skip the turn. And I think we might just have Hen just have her baby here. I don't know. We're still really low on food, though. Um, I'm not really sure what we should do because we're still really low on food. I don't know if we should have her baby yet. Um, let's go ahead and move Romeo over this way and see what we can find. And Hen can actually collect berries, so we can have her collect some of those berries too. Get a little bit better on food, but still not the best. Uh, let's go ahead and collect this. We might be able to have baby in the next turn. Um, let's go ahead and have Romeo over here. Then you can collect these berries and um, no more berries over here. So I think we're going to go ahead and put Hen right here. Build a nest. And she can go ahead, ha I'll go ahead and have her baby right there. And no other turns. Let's go ahead and skip the turn. Let's see what Copa and Hen's little baby looks like. Hopefully she has some very good genes. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Normal blood clotting. You are a healthy baby. We have the normal eyesight. And she has claw and runner's leg. Awesome. Oh my goodness. You, you are a healthy baby. You are a very healthy baby. She has H and F immunity. And she has the green eyes, just like her mother and her father as well. I'm so happy that she's a healthy baby. <laughs> I'm so happy. Oh my goodness. She does have hind legs. She does have the ram horns. Let's do a little quick cheat sheet. She is pretty strong. She has four strength. She has a little bit of fishing. Odor disguise, a little bit of stealth, a little bit of camouflage. So yeah, let's go ahead and take a look at this. Um, we do have claw now that we can use. So that is pretty cool. Normal eyesight. Oh, I'm so happy that she's healthy. <laughs> I'm just so happy she's healthy, baby. Uh, we're going to name her... Hmm. <laughs> I kind of want to name her... I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking... Nova. I'm going to name her Nova for now. Uh, I think that would be a very good name for her. A very strong and healthy female. What did I just do? I just... I just broke the nest. <laughs> I didn't know you could do that, but I guess you can break the nest. So at least we know that Hen and Kopi can make some pretty good babies. So we are going to have them breed again and build another nest because unfortunately we broke the other one that we made. Uh, let's have Kopi or Kopa collect um, some berries over here. We can have... Kiara collects some berries over here as well. And then right now we have little Romeo as our scout. So we can continue on this way and move out over here. Uh, let's do a quick little look around now of what we can hear and what we can smell. So we do have everything that we can get right now. Unfortunately, I keep changing the names. Romeo. There you go, Romeo. Hate it when that happens. Uh, Romeo doesn't have a lot of time left in his life, though, so we're definitely going to have to think about that as well. Um, we're having a rough start here. We're having a rough start, but I have faith in this tribe. We can do good things with the Berry Leaf tribe. If we, we just need to believe. We just need to believe we can fly, and then we can fly. Uh, but let's go ahead and skip the turn, and hopefully this baby will also be pretty healthy. And we have nimble fingers. We have the normal eyesight. And we have normal blood clotting and GNF immunity. Yes! Healthy baby! Healthy baby is healthy. Um, green eyes, just like mommy and daddy. Oh my gosh, yes. I'm so happy. It's working! We're getting some healthy babies. We're getting some very healthy babies. And this is a little boy. We are going to name him... Um, we're going to name him Leaf. Because he is a collector. Um, he has the nimble fingers. And let's see. He is collecting two. And this is the Berry Leaf Tribe, so we are going to name him Leaf. Um, so that is going to be his name, a little leaf over here. He looks like a little Dalmatian. He's so cute. I'm so happy Hen and um, <laughs> Copa are having healthy babies. That makes me so happy. 
Um, so Copa can move over here. We can move Hen over this way. And we might as well start burden again. Uh, we don't have another nest yet, though. Let's go ahead and get some berries. Because we are running... Oh my gosh, look at Nova! Look at that ear! Look at you! I love it. I love your derpy ear. Oh my goodness. You are amazing. And I think your brother has the ear, too. Oh, yeah. So cute. So very cute. Um, Copa, actually, why don't you move over here to get some of these berries? Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> I don't know. They're so derpy looking. And we're going to put Hen, I guess. I don't really know. I mean, we could have her build another nest. Um, but running a little bit low on food. Not too bad, though. Let's go ahead and have Romeo kind of wander out this way. Oh, he doesn't have a lot of time left to live. We can move him over here. Do we have any um, creatures with the cracking ability? Let's go ahead and take a look uh, really quickly at the creatures that we have. And let's see. No cracking. Um, we do have Leaf. Leaf can crack. So Leaf can get the nuts over there. And yeah, so Leaf is going to be good for the Berry Leaf tribe. He is going to be able to collect um, tons of food for us. Let's go ahead and have Han. I kind of want to have her build a nest again. Just because I'm excited. Because we keep having better babies. There we go. We have this nest like up here. <laughs> that is so cute. Alright, so let's go ahead and skip the turn. Hopefully we get another healthy baby. And... <gasps> nice! Awesome! No hemophilia. Good eyesight. And good paws. Good paws are happening. Oh, they're a good pair. Han and Copa. I knew. It was love at first sight. Um, G and B immunity. I'm so happy. Guys, we're doing it. Um, this is another little girl with another little derpy ear, just like mommy. Oh my gosh. We're gonna name her... I kind of want to name her Flop, because she has, like, the floppy ear, and, like, I'm just so amazed at how adorable it is. So we're gonna name her Little Flop over here. And let's have Kiara go ahead and collect these berries. She is getting older. Kiara's not gonna be with us that much longer which is very sad, and unfortunately no other males kind of like appeared. Uh, let's go ahead and have Romeo um, start looking. We do have another berry bush over here, but he's unable to collect it. So we can have him- oh, another berry bush over here too. Nice! We found more food! Uh, we're gonna have Han pop over here and breed with Rome or with Copo. Cop Cop <laughs> Copa! Sometimes the names get a little bit twisted. Uh, let's move Leaf out of here. And we could, we could have a hen pop in the nest once again. So let's go have her pop in the nest. And Nova, why don't we start moving you towards the berry bushes that are this way? There we go. And let's go ahead and skip the turn. Let's see the last baby um, of this episode that they're going to have. Oh my goodness, look at you. You have the face like your daddy. And we do have hemophilia in the recessive. We do have normal eyesight, and we do have some good paws, so I'm so happy. I'm so happy with that. You're doing good. We're doing good with this. Um, we're going to name this little girl... Hmm. <laughs> thinking. Thinking of a name. We are going to name... I kind of want to name her Aerie. We're going to name her Aerie for now. Um, but yeah, so I have good hopes for this tribe. We are going to continue on. Hopefully we can make some healthier babies. We are getting rid of the hemophilia and the eyesight and the no paw, which is amazing. And I'm excited to see. But I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Niche. And let me know what you guys think about the new Berry Leaf tribe. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.